the Oakland Police Department with me now on the phone. Uh, are you there, officer? I am, yes, hello. Thank, thank you for joining us. Uh, you're live on CNN. This is Poppy Harlow in New York, and we're gonna pull up these live pictures uh, that we are seeing out of Oakland, California. Early, a little earlier tonight out of Oakland, California, you see uh, protesters who've gathered. What can you tell us about the protests that took place this evening and what's going on right now? Sure. Well, thank you for asking. First of all, uh, one of the most important messages we wanted to send to our community through media channels was that we were here full staffing, um, have a lot of resources in place to facilitate a peaceful uh, march, uh, certainly uphold freedom of speech, have conversations, listen, be listened to, and be heard. That was the most important message in a peaceful and safe environment. Unfortunately, uh, later this evening, uh, we had a turn of events where a crowd went from several hundred to about 7,000. During uh, later in the evening, the, about 7,000, uh, we had splintered groups that uh, broke off and they began vandalizing various areas of our downtown. Uh, the vandalism ranged from lighting uh, objects on fire, broken windows, uh, uh, vandalism. But what is really concerning is when it turns violent assault towards officers. We have a couple of officers injured. Uh, some went to the hospital as well as uh, we had two outside agency patrol cars burned. How are the, I, this is the first that, that we are hearing of these officers who've been injured. Mm -hmm. What can you tell us about, about their condition right now and, and, and what, what happened in these clashes? So uh, again, uh, we tried to uh, facilitate a peaceful protest, uh, communicating with the various groups, trying to establish communication uh, so it is peaceful for everyone. Uh, again, uh, 7,000 people is a very large crowd, especially for a law enforcement agency of 753 officers, and we pulled everyone in for staffing, including uh, partnering with our uh, neighboring law enforcement agencies. Still, 7,000 is uh, quite a large crowd for us. But again, it wasn't the whole crowd. These are splinter groups uh, that often will break off, as they did tonight, and they'll engage in criminal activity. Uh, having said that, um, uh, the earlier uh, portion of our, our rally protest march was, was very peaceful until later in the evening uh, when it took a different turn. About the outcome of this election, crowds right now blocking parts of the 101, that major freeway right near downtown Los Angeles. Take a look and, and listen to this. This is the voice of Stu Mundell. He's the aerial photographer and reporter for KCBS. Moments ago, listen. Just this is the crowd that we've seen earlier this evening. Uh, you know, there was there were th probably thousands out here earlier this evening and on, on the steps of City Hall. And that group that we saw er that what, that we saw originally out here on the freeway might have been a hundred. So now the other larger group has made their way out here earlier on. We saw the entire southbound lanes out here of the 101 completely filled with people. Something happened, and then they all started running. Possibly an officer may have done, made a move or something like that, but this crowd started running out here, a lot of them getting them their ways off the freeway onto the roads that run next to the 101 freeway here in the downtown area, and that's what the crowds were seeing right there. Now, they are spilling back out onto the streets, but they are, some of them are still down there on the freeways, but you can, Tom is correct, it has been completely overrun by people this evening out here. Uh, the uh, officers that were down there taking care of the couple hundred, now they're going to need probably ten times more officers to take care of this large crowd and also look how they're just spread out it isn't a one spot where they're all just kind of in an area they are all over the 101 freeway down here this evening you've got some of them actually standing on the uh, K rails between the two free sides of the freeway down there these might be some of these might be uh, people that are in their cars just kind of getting out to take a look around but a lot of them are protesters and just basically walking around out here this uh, evening pedestrian rules. That's basically what's happening. These cars out here are all just stopped. Uh, people just kind of taking over the uh, 101 freeway this evening. I understand. I, we heard that one person talking about uh, this is a, they, they're angry about Trump being elected. I, I don't know how this is going to solve that problem. 
uh, if you want to call it that. But, uh, you know, it, it is, yes. All right, that is our... President-elect, we reject the president-elect. We reject the president-elect.
that Donald Trump is a disaster for this country, that our country will most likely go into ruins, that this man cannot handle the responsibility of being commander-in-chief, that this man cannot solve the problems of economic inequality. Let me we messed up. We messed up. The American up. people have failed, we messed up. and they have shown the world that democracy may not be a good thing. We have to be, we have to be, we have to be, we hard, hard. Posted on Facebook, even in secret private Facebook sites. I want everybody coming out from behind that and make sure your voices are heard going forward. Posted on Facebook even in secret private Facebook sites. I want everybody coming out from behind that and make sure your voices are heard going forward. Post it on Facebook, even in secret private Facebook sites. I want everybody coming out from behind that and make sure your voices are heard going forward. Post it on Facebook, even in secret private Facebook sites. I want everybody coming out from behind that and make sure your voices are heard going forward. Posted on Facebook, even in secret private Facebook sites. I want everybody coming out from behind that and make sure your voices are heard going forward. Uh, we have to be sugar-coated.